Hello, hello, I'm back again. Listen, what I would like to talk about tonight is improvisation, okay? Improvisation in music terms, uh, whatever you play, whether it be piano, guitar, saxophone, flute, whatever you play, it's strictly about playing what you feel from your heart, whatever you hear, okay? Uh, not necessarily sticking to the script or sticking to something that was written you basically playing just off the cuff. Uh, the rappers like to call it freestyling, okay? Rapping off the top of their heads. So it's the same thing. You're, you're playing certain things uh, from your heart and what you hear, okay? Now, that's what traditional jazz was about. It was strictly about uh, improvisation. Um, in the likes of Miles Davis, Wes Montgomery, Charlie Parker, uh, uh, Duke Ellington, Thelonious Monk, um, just to name a few, those guys, you know, those, those, are, those are our predecessors, okay? Uh, when they were around, they played strictly improvisational, meaning if they played uh, for an audience uh, daily or every night, or whatever, they played the same songs, but they always played them different, okay? So years later, about 30 years ago, to date, I guess, uh, the record industry created this genre called uh, smooth jazz. Now, there's a big, di big difference between smooth jazz and traditional jazz. Now, smooth jazz means that uh, you got, first of all, you got uh, several genres rolled into one, which the record labels, they, they're urging their artists to be more commercial in order to sell records. Um, uh, um, basically, getting back to the traditional side, um, um, let's let's take West Montgomery for example. West Montgomery, um, 1967, he earned a Grammy for a cover of uh, "Going Out of My Head" by originally by Little Anthony and the Imperials. Okay, that's the first Grammy he ever received. Now, years before that, he's been playing to clubs and you know different nightclubs, you know jazz. You know that's that was a thing back in the day. You know. Um, but when, when they made him do Going Out of My Head, um, uh, his audience grew, his audience base grew. Oh, he wouldn't have liked, he wouldn't have liked smooth jazz at all because it was, smooth jazz is about restriction. It, it restricts you to playing uh, status quo, stand, playing a certain way, staying in line. You know, those guys didn't like that because uh, um, um, playing to status quo uh, it, it, it basically, it restricted you. It restricted you to play a certain way, you know. And with smooth jazz, your records had to be a whole lot shorter, too, time-wise, you know. T traditional jazz, if you go back and look at an old record, that a Miles Davis record or a Charlie Parker record, you'll notice that on their songs, uh, the time is like 13 minutes or more, okay? That was standard back in those days. But what I want to do today, I'm going to be... Um, uh, improvising. Um, um, I accumulated a music track uh, recently that I'm going to be playing to. It's not nothing that I'm working on for the album or something that I'm trying to put together. It's just something that's it's just like a vibe. It's like a groove that I'm just vibing to along with it. And and I'm going to be improvising with it. I'm going to be playing whatever I feel. Okay. I'm going to give you an example of that. All right. Uh, listen to this.